Six tonight, doctors at Eisenhower are seeing more cases of flu and respiratory viruses in the last two months than they've seen in the last five years during the same time frame. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price found out why and what an ER doctor says you can do to keep your family healthy. Miyoshi. Hi, Peter. We found out that at Eisenhower, there's been a 71% increase in cases of influenza since just last week. Nearly three out of four of those patients are under 18. Here's what one doctor is dealing with, the influx, and what you need to know. My son and daughter-in-law, they're very aware of, you know, if they have sniffles, they did stay away from us for a good two weeks until they're better. Betty Moon is like many of us doing our very best not to get sick during flu season. Oh, we're seeing a, a marked increase in people with flu, RSV, and other respiratory viruses. Dr. Yutham Kontaxis is the medical doctor at Tinity Emergency with Eisenhower Health. He said we should expect flu to continue to spread. The latest measurements we obtained from Eisenhower Health show a record number of influenza and respiratory syncytial virus at their facility. This chart shows case numbers reached the highest number in the last five years for October and November. But the emergency room isn't the only option if symptoms are not severe. Contact their primary physician, do a, a telehealth call. Sometimes that can be all they need to get the right kind of uh, direction. Should people get together because holidays are coming up? Uh, yes, unless you're sick, then you got to stay home because you're thinking of others. Please don't sneeze all over the turkey at the uh, Thanksgiving table. Betty Moon says she will continue wiping surfaces down with her Clorox wipes. Although, you know, we are susceptible like anybody else, but uh, we are taking good precautions and we all keep well. As far as emergency room wait times, while there are high right now, they're always varying. So the hospital could not give me an estimate time on how long you have to wait if you head to the ER. Flu shots are free at many pharmacies. I'm live in studio, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.